I'm a self-professed bronzaholic, and I believe everyone should get their glow on too. But there's a right way to use bronzer, and it involves two other products. So I'm gonna show you how to apply bronzer, blush, and luminizer. Now, I'm a big advocate of bronzer because it can really warm up your skin tone and shape your face. Case in point, this is me without bronzer. It's a subtle touch that can make a huge difference. If you're new to bronzing, first choose a matte bronzer, not a shimmery one, and make sure it's just a couple of shades darker than your skin tone. The easiest way to apply it is to simply swipe the bronzer across the high points of your face, near your hairline, the center of your forehead, slightly under your cheekbones, which is why I like to use an angled brush like this one, and your chin. To connect the color with the rest of your body, also swipe bronzer around your jawline and down the center of your neck. See the difference already? It really starts to shape your face. But you don't want to stop there. Bronze skin always has a natural flush to it, so apply blush for some added dimension. I like to use a peachy coral color for a natural look. Use a regular blush brush to softly apply the blush to the roundest point on your cheeks usually the apples. Don't worry if you apply too much because next, we're going to blend using a big soft kabuki brush. At this point, you should have a beautiful glow, but I like to top it off with a luminizer for added dimension. Choose a luminizer with a golden tone and using a sponge brush, swipe it under your brows, at the highest point of your cheekbones, just under your eyes, and down the center of your nose. Then check yourself in the mirror and there you have it, a perfectly bronzed face and glow. To see more tutorials, don't forget to subscribe to our new beauty magazine channel here on YouTube. I'm Susan Yara, and thanks for watching.